I'm Robert Langham and I've just recently uh, successfully got myself a job with Whole New Theatre and City Hall. It took me almost the good end of eight years and that's been through doing a number of courses and including those courses it's uh, included a, an apprenticeship. After that um, I was on Job Seekers for maybe I'd say three, four months and then uh, when I went through my mum, she told me that whole city council was recruiting for a um, whole new theatre and without a shadow of a doubt, I just dashed over to the nearest computer and tried to get my name in the hat. Yeah, Robert. Yeah, I went permanent first, didn't get it. But then through the support of MC4C, they encouraged me to uh, go and apply for the casual post. So I did. And to my surprise, I got an interview. And then from that, transpired saying that I was suitable. Good afternoon, sir. KK26 and 27. KK26, 27, which is just on that far section there. And it's about the middle row. I did a course called Discover Creative with Endeavour to... Um, which to bring out to um, bring out my creative skills and try and hopefully find a job, but casually through them they just happened to mention Whole Truck Theatre, so I went on their website to see if there was any voluntary opportunities and there was, so I, off my own back I applied, filled out the application form, had a chat with the, the front of house manager, and there you have it. I was just volunteering, and uh, through that I gained some. In, some valuable experience gaining um, customer service face to face, um, shadowing the stage for help and safety and helping people find the seats, just general things around the theatre. And that has significantly helped me in order to gain this job with New Theatre. Whilst I was pursuing a job in business and admin, um, MC4C told me about uh, a Sage course that would use, help me to uh, do finance. Um, computer financing and I thought that was an opportunity too, too good to miss. So I took that and I successfully passed all the tests that I needed and got the qualifications. When Robert came, came in he, he was worried, he was very anxious, he didn't think he'd be able to do it at all. Um, he also wanted to do it quickly because if there was a job on the horizon he wanted to make sure that he'd got his qualification before he went. Um, and I said to him, I can do it as, as quickly as you want to do it, Robert, however many times you want to come in. I want to come every day. I've never had that before. I want to come in every single day. So he came, I think, on the Friday of the first week and we started off. I thought he won't come on the Monday. He did. He came on the Monday. He came every single day. And by the end of that week, he'd completed all the modules, all of his tests, his practice tests, then he did his finals and he completed the whole qualification in six days. It's possible. I mean, it's 30 guided learning hours, so it is possible to do it, but nobody, not even on a private basis, has anybody gone through. And he was so excited. He rang me nearly every day to ask me if the certificates had come in. Have they arrived yet? And I said to him, they're going to be two to three weeks before they actually come through. Are they, are they there yet? No, they're not there. He would ring Kirsty. Would you ask Di if they've arrived? Um, and I rang him and I said, they've arrived now. Can I come back and you? Come when you, when you want, Robert. So he came running in to get his certificates. When I was told about MC40 initially, I thought, not really, because it was all to set up their own business. But when I found out that they supported people into employment, I thought it was an opportunity too, too good to miss. So I think if anyone else wants to join, it's a good way to, to support both sides. There's your receipt. Thank you. There you go, sir. Enjoy the Thank show. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you.